this isn't gonna end well. <laughs> Never trust the wheels on any piece of furniture or any cabinet or any chair or anything like that. Always use your own wheels or carry the piece. Not a smooth move, driver. These guys look like they're moving a heavy dresser. No padding. Oh, you gotta watch your step. Always, always watch your step and look where you're going when moving heavy items. Don't be looking away or looking at someone else. You need to really watch what you're doing and communicate with your partner on the other end of the piece. It's for your safety and the safety of the furniture. Keep it moving. Oh man, he was trying to pull that box out of the back of the pickup truck. He was trying to use the handles. If there's a heavy item inside those little handle holes, definitely won't hold up 100% of the time. Make sure you wiggle the sides of the box to get it out and then lift from underneath the box to get a good grip. Keep it moving. Here they go, they're trying to pull the whole shit onto the steps or mobile home. <laughs> Definitely inquire for sound advice from a professional on moving some kind of house or mobile home to secure it to the foundation. And as always, keep it moving. Oh, oh, what's up with all the tape? It's a tight squeeze. Okay, they're taking the door off. Standard issue. Those forearm forklifts are awful, awful. And you need to have that padded coming through the door, boys. Well, they got it moved, but at what expense? Their back's hurt and the fridge is probably scratched. What's your guys' experience with moving a heavy fridge like that? How did you do it? Leave your feedback in the comments below. Keep it moving.